Good morning, folks. And the earth shook. As you know, we started yesterday with two 8 magnitude quakes in Indonesia and a barrage of aftershocks. Not long after that, a 5.9 hit off the coast of Oregon. A 7 pointer hit Mexico. Just this morning, two separate massive quakes hit Baja. There was a 4.5 up here in Canada. You are right up there, Stone. There was also a separate 4 pointer in Utah. Seismic servers are a little scary, eh? Now, if I had to guess, you know I think these quakes could be correlated to the space weather we had yesterday combined with Saturn opposing the sun just three days away. Before I discuss the space weather we did get yesterday, this is the magnetopause and many folks were saying it reversed yesterday. It did not. There is some strong pressure here and uh, I believe it was a tiny CME. If I may replace some video from yesterday, Ovation Prime showed mild particle precipitation and the electron flux was evident. Solar wind density jump is evident on SOHO and also here on the orange on ACE. Further proving that it was a CME, going back in time here on Space Weather, you may remember that a CME that erupted on the 5th was supposed to hit on the 9th. It missed. Well, this one from the 5th right here did miss, uh, but one two days later on the 7th did not. And if the eruption on the 5th missed on the 9th, then the eruption on the 7th should have been what caused those readings on the 11th. Back to today, a red alert has been issued for this volcano. An eruption is imminent. A lithium-ion battery exploded at a GM plant. Mercury was found at a playground in Pickering, Ontario. A major oil spill at a Texas refinery as well. The deadliest event near India yesterday was actually severe weather, killing at least 40 people near Bangladesh. While the tsunami warnings abounded here, the real dangerous wave was flipping boats and causing, uh, causing other damage in New Zealand. The Korean missile, I mean uh, satellite, is fueled and ready to launch any time. We are seeing minor disturbances today on the magnetometers here. The cosmic radiation is penetrating the magnetosphere. Ovation Prime shows significant particle bombardment. Solar wind speed spiking, as you can see here on ACE and up there on the red, the BZ tipped south. Spike is evident here on SOHO as well. Perhaps the coronal hole stream is striking already. This would be about 12 hours early. There are some magnetic filaments and active regions on the Earth-facing disk. Space weather and Saturn. Quake Watch continues. Be safe, everyone.